The dangers of children's online information getting into the wrong hands. I don't get The wrong it. hands, Danny. We're the wrong hands. True. We got some thieving to do. We're gonna kidnap a kid? Danny, please. Kids these days barely talk to strangers, and none of them go to some creepy shack in the middle of nowhere to see the friendly stranger they met on the internet no more. Kids know that that's stupid. True. We've got some information thieving to do. You know the face thing? Right. And the tweetamajig? Yeah. Well, some kids have their privacy settings so lax that even strangers can see the contact him. Nice. So, we checked the face thing, and now we know where they live, right? And the tweetamajig says that the whole family's out of town this week. Nice. Unoccupied house? Yes, please. They're in the hotel. We're robbing their place. Nice. I'm telling you, this is easier than taking candy from a baby. This is taking candy from a baby who is giving you candy. True. Now, just fixing the privacy settings would keep us out. But these kids, smart as they are, have not caught on yet. True. You know, we could also pretend to sell Jamie's concert tickets. tickets. Love that guy. Always say I'll Never say copyright. So, kids come to our site. We offer half-price tickets. They give us their info and the credit card number. Kids with the credit this card? This is JP we're talking about. They'll use a parent's number if they have to. True. Now, you're supposed to only give out your bank info on secure HTTPS. Look at me, I got a green lock website. What? Oh, you know, like this. True. But here's the thing, nobody ever checks. True. So it's no problem. They give us their info, we give them an error 500, internal service something, I don't know. Nice. Money in the bank. True. You know, you say true too much. That is true. Seriously, check your social networks and make sure your personal information, especially contact information, is not available to everyone. And beware of letting strangers know about your location through your face thing or your tweet imaging. Also seriously, when dealing with money, check if the website is secure. If you're new to a website that's asking for money, research the site to find out if it's a scam. Also, also seriously, don't go to creepy shacks in the middle of nowhere to see the friendly stranger you met on the internet. Don't be stupid. Why are we made of paper? Not entirely clear.